Vice President Dana White. And we're always looking for up and coming talent to sign. Back in the day, I used to scout the world looking for new talent. But I haven't done that in years. I'm looking for the next Ronda Rousey, the next Robbie Lawler, the next Conor McGregor. I'm looking for future champions. And I'm willing to go to any show, anywhere in the world to find them. Super excited about the talent on tonight's card. A lot of tough fighters. Let's see who really wants their shot at the UFC. This should be interesting. You never know, this might be a potential guy. Look at this. Look, over the top. Oh! That kid has a lot of talent and a lot of potential. We're going to do this. We're going to give him a shot in the UFC.
everyone, I'm Megan O'Levy, and this is your UFC Minute. The UFC returns this weekend with a fresh face who is destined to make headlines. When UFC President Dana White went looking for a fight, he was hoping that he would end up with a future UFC star. And to his Octagon debut this weekend. That's it for today. Stay tuned for your next UFC Minute, and I'll see you at the fights. Coming up next, a UFC lightweight division bout. Well, he was discovered on Dana White looking for a fight, and man, did he come through with style points that night. As such, here he is, making his UFC debut a few short months later, and the question beckons, will there be jitters? We hear a lot about those UFC nerves, and sometimes it leads to an adrenaline dump, and that can be the difference in a win or a loss. So if he can bottle the nerves and deal with the bright lights of the famed octagon, there is no denying the skill set, the skills, the demeanor. That's what got him to the big show. We'll see if he can perform now in the UFC. This guy's an excellent grappler. What he wants to do here is get this fight, maybe press his opponent up against the cage, bring the fight to the ground, use his ground and pound and his submission skills. And now our tale of the tape for this lightweight fight. Four years, the difference in age between these two fighters, some differences in height and reach as well. And now for the particulars, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC lightweight division. Introducing first, fighting, and out of the blue corner, making his UFC debut here tonight. He stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of London, England, the Destroyer. And now here's his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. A jiu-jitsu fighter holding professional record of four wins, three losses. He stands five feet ten inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of the tall Brazil, bad intention. And when the action begins, a record. You ready to fight? Ready. And we are underway. All right, here we go with round one. This is a moment every fighter dreams of, to cross into the big show and make the UFC debut. If fight week is any indication... Oh! He's melting, that's it. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. He's got full guard here. And he's back up. Well, he left his body wide open there for that hook shot, Joe, and he paid for it. He is leaning in. I know he's got the guard high, but that means the body is exposed, and the opposition took full advantage there. Nice combination of jabs. Oh! oh. Big right punches up. here. Right he's back to his feet, but he's hurt. Oh, straight right. Clearly in big, big trouble oh. here. Oh. Another knockdown! Oh, good straight left! Oh! oh. He's oh. out! Oh, he dropped him! Beautiful knockout blow to finish the fight here. Yeah, there's another one for the highlight reel, Joe, and that's probably as good a knockout as he's had in the UFC. Just a perfect shot to end the fight. Crowd absolutely loving it. Flush land to close out his opponent. I'm not even sure the other fighter saw it coming. So a big knockout for him here tonight on the biggest of stages. Let's take one more look at this overhand right on the money. And the fight is over as soon as it lands. And here we see it one more time. Look at the timing in this shot. I mean, just stiff. Well, what a moment for him here tonight. A huge knockout on one of the sport's biggest stages. That is one they'll be talking about for some time. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at one minute, 53 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, the destroyer. All right, so congratulations to the winner off to a nice 1-0 start in the UFC. This was his promotional debut, and it could not have gone much better for him here tonight as he starts to celebrate with his coaches and teammates. Congratulations to the UFC newcomer.